a name that strikes even greater fear to the hearts of bad men everywhere. Lightning Larry! We'll never forget the day Larry rode into a little town of Brimstone and walked into the Cottonmouth Saloon. He strode up in, um, to the bar and smiled straight at the bartender. Lemonade, please. Every head in the place turned to look. Now sitting right next to Lightning Larry was a bad man named Crooked Kirk. Crooked Kirk was one of a band of those that had been here in town, led by a famous outlaw named Elon Eagle. Kurt was wearing the usual <laughs> outlaw scowl. Larry turned to him and smiled. Might have a crown that you got there, Mister. What is it? You. Well, maybe I can help remove it. I let the few try. The rest of us got out of the way real fast. The bartender ducked behind the bar. Larry and Kurt moved about ten paces from each other, hands at the ready. Larry was still smiling. Kurt moved first, but he only just cleared his gun from its holster before Larry aimed and fired. Ding! There's no being noble to a little more place that hard. Then he dropped his gun. And a huge grin spread over his face. The rest of Tulare and come to sand. I'm really glad to know you, stranger. Everything's on me. Good morning for everyone. outlaw gang heard that Crooked Kurt had gone straight, they shuddered right down to their boots. Most any outlaw would rather die than smile. Evil Eye's men were shook up, but they weren't about to let on. The very next day, Dismal Dan, don't push your dick, and for two days, rode into Brimstone yelling like crazy men and shooting. <laughs> Window shattered? Just shot three little bolts of light. Ding, ding, ding. Hit those outlaws right in the heart. Larry's shots knocked out the outlaws to, to the ground. They lay there trying to figure out what had hit them. Then they got up and looked around. Looks like we did some damage, boys, said this old Dan. Hope nobody got hurt, said Devilish Dick. Said Dreadful yes. Dave. They spent the rest of the day replacing windows and water and everyone who was missing. And for good measure, they picked up all the trash in the street. Evil Eye McNeil had lost three more of his meanest men. And he was furious. He decided to do something really nasty. The next day, Stinky Steve, Stinky Dinky Sid. Walked into the 79th National Savings and Loan with guns in hand. They wore bandanas, but everyone knew who they were from the smell. Stick up your hands, said Stinky Steve. Give us all the money in your vault, ordered Sickening Sid. They were just backing out of the door with the bags of money. Lightning Larry strolled by. Didn't even slow his step. Just shot those bandits in the back. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> Went right through to the heart. The puzzled outlaws stopped and looked at each other. Seems a shame to steal the money of hardworking cowboys. We want them to go off any harder. They holstered their guns and walked back to the teller.
Evil Eye was waiting for him, but Evil Eye wasn't alone. There on either side of him were... Creepy Caroline, Babsy Luke. And not one of them looked friendly. Last day for a stroll. Yeah. All of us citizens of Brewston were lining up, lining Main Street to see what would happen. He was still smiling, but we knew even Larry couldn't have shoot all the rest of us together. Just then, a voice came from the Cottonmouth Saloon. Want some help, Larry? What am I, Nick? Out stepped Crooked Kurt, and right behind him were Dismal Dan, Devilish Dick, and Dreadful Dave. They all took places beside Larry. Traitors. Draw! Evil Eye and his men drew their guns. Larry and his friends were an eye blink quicker. Their guns fired little bolts of light. Zing! Hit those outlaws right in the you-know-what. Yippee! He shot in the air. Zing! There was no bang and no bullet, just a little bolt of light. All right, man, let's come up this time once and for all. Zing! 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 And before we could duck for cover, Larry and Evil Eye and the others turned their guns on the rest of us. Bolts of light flew everywhere. No one was spared. Not a man, woman, or child. Yippee! <laughs> Never saw such a happy crowd. We all rushed around. Pumped each other's hands and hugged each other. <laughs> then the musicians got out instruments and we had dancing too. Hi, my name is Evan. My favorite DS game is Plants vs. Zombies. 